everybody's waiting, everybody's watching, even when you're sleeping, keep your eyes Apart from that, it was quite repetitive. You know, yeah, there wasn't yeah. much substance in the song. It's just repeating the same thing: keep your eyes open, your eyes open. You know, everybody's watching, even when you're sleeping, sleeping. Everybody's watching, watching. So yeah, I mean, it's quite repetitive the way it is structured. But uh, yeah, I like the way the rock music was added in. Uh, I don't know who the guitarist is or the drummer is, but their contribution definitely had an impact in making this sound better. The voice of Taylor Swift is quite average. Uh, it sounds like an uh, average voice, you know. Um, but the well, problem here is not the voice or the music. It's with the way it is repeated so often. Right. If it wasn't repeated that often, definitely I would have had a lot of good things to say about it. Yes, this is a this is an issue with lots of people, especially those in the you know public eye, so to speak, public eye. I. 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 Yeah. So, if, uh, 
those who are in the public eye definitely they they every step is monitored i just watched a wonderful movie uh called uh, familyhood south korean movie oh, there uh, nice you know an actress she is constantly in the public eye every little step she makes every little move is monitored is talked about is discussed and it has a big effect on her it has an impact on her everything she does also you know it's kind kind of it determines her career more or less as an actress so yeah i you i just watched this movie so this song is quite connected to that movie it's like as if you know it's part of that movie you know if it this song was put in that movie it would be extremely fitting the family hood movie in south korea even taylor um, swift's personal life also may fit in very well uh, with age factor and things yeah, like that yeah she is you know, uh, she people. sounds like a child literally when she's singing this mm. a teenager or something but she looks quite old you know i remember seeing yeah. an episode of kids say the dance yes. things she and in did. that she had a back bend her shoulders were drooping she looked exhausted she looked tired you know it's like she's 55 to 60 years old but i think she is younger the way she sounds she is she is younger than that but she looks quite old so i think these things do take a toll on her personally and definitely the sound the song even though it's in general it might be about something extremely Very personal to her yeah, there was some sword fighting in the backyard that and all, that all the childhood games and all the childhood games and all i don't know who she was referring to mm-hmm. whether she has a cousin brother she has a sister she's talking about a father a mother who knows who all are involved in this but it seems personal and definitely takes a toll on her because she looks so old she looks so old she sounds so young like a child but she looks like madonna's age literally madonna looks younger than her you know i've seen both oh, of them recently i've seen them on uh, on the screen and madonna literally looks younger than taylor swift so that says a lot about you know the toll that mm-hmm. being in the public eye has taken on taylor swift mm-hmm. and how beautifully madonna has handled it on the other hand uh, yeah. Love yeah. Uh, yeah, she loves that. Yeah. Yeah, she's she's something different. Uh anyway, coming to the song, I like the theme of the song. I like uh you know um enlightening the um, uh, audience or the listeners of the first about how things are very simple when you are young. You know, doing the sword fight, doing silly things, winning, losing didn't matter. Nothing mattered. It was all so simple, all so easy in life. But then suddenly things change, and suddenly you know people are literally waiting for your fall, uh, uh, fall out, uh, as mentioned in the song. So there are people actually waiting for you to falter somewhere. There are people actually waiting for you to make some mistake. Not because it benefits them directly. Also, at times you know it doesn't even benefit the opposite person. But also they just get that um, sadistic pleasure out of somebody's fall. and that is what you know makes uh, everybody feel under pressure but i uh, you know for us on inova today we are reacting to music from this era and almost like in the last decade or so maybe um, most of these songs may be from and we have reacted to 60 years uh, older songs also or maybe you know the entire quite a lot hundreds yeah, a lot of, of it. from the 60s so for us it does not matter what we do and what people think and are people thinking of us falling down or you know making a mistake it does not matter if you have your vision clear all of these things to me yeah when we are here we are here to sit down and listen to music and give our honest open. unscripted yeah. open impromptu review on it it's as simple as that i hope you enjoy this review it's as honest as it will get uh, i don't think anyone else on youtube will be as open and honest as us when it comes to artists such as taylor swift and we all know why that's a different story